Hi, good morning, it's John in Thailand. I'm uh, just having a look at the, uh, I hope, temporary repairs to the to the little bridge over the Klong. Uh, the, about six days ago we had a huge rainstorm flooded out around the back of the house in my shed and did some serious damage out here. Um, yeah, so you can see how all the, all the greenery has all been pushed over because the water came across here and across the other side. Uh, yesterday someone came out here and put some stones in the little bridge or on the little bridge try and level it up so we can get tractors across I don't know who did it maybe one of the farmers did it uh, it'll, it'll have to do maybe the council will come and fix it up later on but uh, this is the clong the water levels down to a reasonable point now uh, there's another I don't know, it's a bit hard to see. <laughs> there's, a, there's another you know, water course, I suppose you could call it, that goes from uh, goes from the lice paddy over there into the Klong. Uh, probably better to see it from this side. That's the lice paddy in there. The Klong goes around there. So yeah, yeah, I guess in uh, my country we'd call it a culvert over here in Thailand, I'm not quite sure what they call it but some of the corn here has been pushed over but it probably probably still grow and it's not far away from you know, being able to be picked, it's got to dry off a bit because um, this corn goes to be ground at the CP mill for for stock feed, pigs and I guess chicken and whatever else but there's been a been a lot of mess, a lot of mess, and the track down here is, well, you can see, it's pretty chopped up, it's usually uh, quite quite good to drive on, or ride on, but it's a bit rough at the moment, <laughs> yeah, so there's another little, uh, I think it's just a, a pipe in the ground that down there and then put some wood and stones on it and then covered it with dirt and um, that's sort of got to be repaired as well. But I've got to go up to ooh, where those trees are up there on the hill. That's Tick's land up there. It's easy to get to when the track's in good condition. It's not really any hard hardship at all. Uh, so when I'm up there, I'll just check the rain gauge and, you know, like, didn't really have a look around. There won't be much wrong. There's not too many people out here that do bad things, but you never know. So anyway, that's my morning. Must be 6.30 now. And, uh, yeah, a lot more to go during the day. Technically, we should have... Should have had the dogs wash yesterday and uh, take them to the vet this morning, but that's not going to happen because I didn't get a wash. Yeah, we do wash our dogs most weeks, not all. <laughs> uh, anyway, have a good day, folks. I'm going to leave you here now. Bye.